For the first time ever, the maximum Social Security benefit is more than $3,000 per month. But does anyone really get close to that amount? Well, the answer is a surprising yes, and it doesn't take as much in earnings as you may think. Stay tuned. Hey, I'm Devin, and this channel is all about simplifying the complicated Social Security system so you can not only understand it, but use the rules to your advantage as well. If you are new here, be sure to hit that subscribe button and that notifications bell. Otherwise, you may never see me again. Now, I said that on my last video, and someone asked me, Devin, what do you mean we may never see you again? Well, let me go off on a rabbit trail here for a moment. YouTube has gotten so big that they no longer notify you of new videos, even if you're a subscriber, unless you explicitly request to be notified with that notifications bell. Now, they're doing this because there's so much content being uploaded now. Now, I know this is a side note to what this video is all about, but this is fascinating. Every minute of every day, there's more than 500 hours of fresh video uploaded to YouTube. So if you work out the math, that means that every day, there's more than 82 years of brand new content added. With this amount of new content, YouTube knows that if they send you notifications for every channel you're subscribed to, you'll just eventually ignore them and it would just be too much to pay attention to. So they've made the decision to only notify those who have explicitly requested the notification from that channel. So be sure to click that notifications bell if you want to see my upcoming videos. Okay, enough about YouTube. Let's get back to the maximum Social Security benefit. So in 2020, for those turning for retirement age, the maximum Social Security benefit is $3,011. Now that's a lot of monthly income. But how likely is it that you'll get that amount or even close to it? After all, the average benefit is about half that amount at $1,503 per month. So how do you get your benefit from the average to the max? Well, the simple answer is earnings, but it may not take as much in earnings as you think. I'll go over some numbers here in just a moment that'll make that clear. But first, let's look at what you have to do to get the full maximum benefit amount. The simple answer is 35 years of real earnings at or above the maximum taxable earnings for Social Security. Now, We've talked about this before in prior videos, but the maximum taxable earnings is the income cap where you have to pay Social Security taxes. Once you attain this income level, you no longer have to pay Social Security taxes on any earnings that are above that. And since you don't pay Social Security taxes on those earnings, the administration will only consider wages up to that taxable wage cap in their calculations. Now for 2020, that number is $137,700 and it generally increases every year in response to the changes in the National Average Wage Index. So for example, in 1984, the maximum wage considered for Social Security taxation was $37,800. Now, needless to say, it's come up over $100,000 since then, but if you wanna see what those historical amounts are, in the description, I'll link up the Social Security webpage that lists out all of the historical uh, taxable wage caps. So the easy way to get the maximum Social Security benefit is to simply make at or above the maximum. But what if you were close to the maximum earnings? Would you still get close to the maximum benefit? This may surprise you, but the Social Security benefit formula is progressive. That means that more credit is giving for lower earnings and less credit is giving for earnings which are approaching that maximum taxable earnings cap. So you can earn less than the maximum wage limit and still receive a benefit that's pretty close to the maximum. So check this out. For example, if you get average wages that were at or above the max, you'd get the maximum benefit. We know that, we've established that. But if your earnings were at 75% of the maximum amount, your benefit would still be at 87% of the maximum benefit. And if your earnings were at 50% of the maximum taxable earnings amount, your benefit would still be at 72% of the maximum benefit. So how can you find out if you're on track for the maximum benefits or getting close to it? First, you need access to your earnings history. You can easily do that on the first page of your My SSA account. And if you haven't already set one up, please do. There's a lot of reasons, but checking your earnings history is probably one of the biggest. Not only to know if it's close to the historical maximums, but to make sure your earnings are being recorded correctly or at all. 
Mistakes happen, and let me tell you, they're not that uncommon. And uh, in the description, I'm going to put a step-by-step -step guide to setting up your My SSA account. So you can go in there if you haven't already to check your earnings history. Once you have your earnings history, sharpen up your pencil and learn how to calculate your own Social Security benefit. There's only three main steps to the calculation, and I break it all down in my video that I will also link up in the description below. And if you'll be patient with me, I'm getting ready to launch. I've been promising this for a while, I know but I am getting ready to launch some free software that's gonna do all the heavy lifting for you. And whether you do it yourself or use my software, you'll be able to experiment with various earning levels to see how it would affect your future benefit amount. There's absolutely no question that getting the maximum social security benefit or even close to it can make your retirement cash flow a lot better. Heck, just knowing more about social security will make your retirement a lot better. And if you want to learn more, be sure to subscribe to this channel and join my Facebook group too. It's very active and lots of questions are being posted there every day. And there's some really smart people who love to answer questions about Social Security. I look forward to seeing you at the Facebook page. Thank you so much for watching. Have a fantastic day.